सॉल्व 24x क्यूब माइनस थर्टी सेवन एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस फोर्टी एक्स प्लस थर्टी सिक्स इक्वल टू जीरो हियर दे टोल्ड एस टू सॉल्व विच मीन्स वी शुड गेट द वैल्यूज ऑफ x. फॉर दैट हियर वी हैव टू चेंज द x टर्म वॉट आई मीन एज सी ट्वेंटी फोर एक्स क्यूब माइनस थर्टी सेवन एक्स स्क्वायर इन प्लेस ऑफ माइनस फोर्टी एक्स नाव आई राइट प्लस फोर्टीन एक्स माइनस फिफ्टी फोर एक्स प्लस थर्टी सिक्स इक्वल टू जीरो डिड यू अंडरस्टैंड इन प्लेस ऑफ माइनस फोर्टी एक्स नाव आई हैव रिटर्न प्लस फोर्टीन एक्स माइनस फिफ्टी फोर एक्स दैट्स इट नेक्स्ट वॉट कैन बी टेकन आउट कॉमन फ्रॉम दीज थ्री टर्म्स इज एक्स सो हियर यू गेट ट्वेंटी फोर एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस फ्रॉम दिस एक्स आउट यू गेट थर्टी सेवन एक्स प्लस फ्रॉम दिस एक्स आउट यू गेट फोर्टीन इन द सेम वे वॉट कैन बी टेकन आउट कॉमन फ्रॉम दीज टू टर्म्स इज माइनस एटीन सो हियर यू गेट थ्री एक्स एंड हियर यू गेट माइनस टू equal to zero now in this equation we have come across quadratic so i will factorize the quadratic here that is 24x square minus 37x plus 14 to factorize this we should split the middle term Minus thirty seven x in place of minus thirty seven x. Now I write minus twenty one x minus sixteen x plus fourteen. I am not doing factorization steps directly. I have split minus thirty seven x to minus twenty one x minus sixteen x. Okay, next. What can be taken out common from these two terms is three x. So here you get eight x minus from this three x out you get seven. Now whatever we got here here also we should get the same thing. From this eight x gone inside so outside you get minus two. Even if you multiply and check still you get the same thing. Now take out eight x minus seven common. So here you have three x, and here minus two. Now, in place of this quadratic, we should write this. I repeat, in place of this quadratic, now I will write this. So this equation will change to x times. 8x minus 7, 3x minus 2. Over here, no change. Equal to zero. Now, from this entire equation, what can be taken out common is 3x minus 2. So 3x minus 2 outside. Over here, we are left with these two. That is x times 8x minus 7, and over here we are left with minus 18 equal to 0. Now 3x minus 2. Here you open up the brackets in this way. You get 8x square minus 7x minus 18 equal to 0. Now we got quadratic. I will factorize the quadratic here. That is. 8x square minus 7x minus 18. To factorize this, we should split the middle term minus 7x. So in place of minus 7x, now I write minus 16x plus 9x minus 18. I am not doing factorization steps. Directly I have split. Minus seven x to minus sixteen x plus nine x. Okay, next.
what can be taken out common from these two terms is 8x. So here you get x minus from this 8x out you get 2. Now whatever you got here, here also you should get the same thing. From this x gone inside, so outside you get plus 9. Even if you multiply and check, still you get the same thing. Now take out x minus 2 common. So here you have 8x and here plus 9. Now in place of this quadratic, we should write this. I repeat, in place of this quadratic, now I will write this. So this equation will change to 3x minus 2, x minus 2, 8x plus 9 equal to 0. More. They told us to solve which means we should get the values of x and over here we got product of brackets equal to 0. So to get x values we should equate each bracket to 0 that is 3x minus 2 equal to 0 x minus 2 equal to 0 8x plus 9 equal to 0. Now to get x value from here, I should remove minus 2, so you add 2. You get 3x equal to 2. Now I should remove 3, so divide by 3. You get x equal to 2 by 3. Now here, I should remove minus 2, so you add 2. You get x equal to 2. Now here, I should remove plus 9, so subtract 9 you get 8x equal to minus 9. Now I should remove 8, so divide by 8. You get x equal to minus 9 by 8. So the x values that we got are 2 by 3, 2 and minus 9 by 8. This is our answer. Am I clear?